always watching, always tracking, so we can warn you first. This is your Storm Team 27 forecast. Ran yesterday afternoon and I was working in the yard too. Boy, I really sweated that day out, but that's not the problem for today. It's going to be much more comfortable to be outdoors, especially with this nice breeze out of the northwest. That's getting rid of that humidity that we had yesterday. And radar shows you that any rain, it's well to the west of us. So I'll have some storms there from Denver to Dallas. We won't even have to worry about those, and you'll see how long we stay dry in our seven-day forecast for now. Here we are dry, and our neighborhood temperatures include 69 in Berlin Center and Austin Town and in downtown Youngstown as well. 71 in Lisbon, 74 in Salem, and 73 in Wellsville in Elwood City. Future Tracker this afternoon shows that break in the clouds and temperatures in the mid to upper 60s for this afternoon. But watch how it cools down. We have that lack of clouds by first news at 5. You're talking about 59 in Cortland and Greenville. Still mid 60s further to the south and it continues to cool down for first news at 6. Temperatures around 60 degrees. So get ready for a cool down for tonight. With the dry air in place, mostly sunny this afternoon, breezy, winds up to 15 miles per hour and 69 for the high than tonight. Partly cloudy, low of 41. Some of the low-lying areas, I bet, will be in the upper 30s, if nothing else. And then, this is the cool day, Wednesday. High of only 58, but at least it's dry. Staying dry on Thursday and Friday. Highs finally in the mid-60s again. And as we hit Saturday, boy, that's going to be the perfect day of this Memorial Day weekend. 70 and partly to mostly sunny there. Great day to fly the flag. But here is the problem area. Sunday into Monday Memorial Day, we have a 60% chance of showers and thunderstorms. But at least the highs up there around 80. And that means that uh, humidity is returning too.